Simvis Gecko is a binocular visual simulator of presbyopic corrections. With Simvis Gecko, patients can experience a natural vision of the real world through premium intraocular lenses, contact lenses, or LASIK refractive surgery. First, ask the patient to remove their glasses. Then hand the device to the patient and ask them to hold it, place their forehead against the pad, and try to look through the oculars. Then adjust the harness. Use the rear wheel to tighten it around the head. Then use the top wheel to adjust the height of the device. Ask the patient to stop holding the device. Tell them that there is no problem if the vision is not perfect because you will adjust it in a minute. Select the lenses on the guided test option. Ask the patient to look through the center of the field of view at a point between your eyes. Align each optical channel horizontally using the lateral wheel and vertically using the top wheel until you see the two LEDs through the system. Once the alignment is completed, in both eyes at the same time, use the iPad to turn off the alignment LEDs. Start by simulating a monofocal lens and ask the patient if their distance vision is clear and natural. Then give the patient a near vision card. Presbyopsis will not have clear vision at near. Ask them if they are able to read. Now, start simulating a trifocal lens and ask the patient if their near vision improves. Starting the trifocal lens while looking at near highlights the visual benefits of these lenses. Ask the patient to explore their vision at near and intermediate distances by moving the near vision card back and forth. Explain the patient that these lenses normally provide good vision at near. Ask the patient to look at far so they can give feedback on their distance vision. Ask if the quality of vision is acceptable. Before switching to a new simulation, ask the patient to look at the near vision card and to close their eyes. Start the Adolf lens simulation and ask the patient to open their eyes and try to read. Again, ask the patient to explore their vision at near and intermediate distances by moving the near vision card back and forth. Ask the patient to look at far to evaluate how they see with this lens and if the image quality is acceptable. Explain to the patient that these lenses tend to give better intermediate vision and functional near vision. EDOF lenses have less benefits at near and less degradation at far distance. As Simvis Gecko is a binocular instrument, different lenses can be simulated in each eye, allowing the simulation of monovision and mix and match. For example, you can set a trifocal lens on the non-dominant eye and an Adolf lens on the dominant eye. Remember to get feedback from the patient at all distances, near, intermediate, and far, to help you understand which might be the best option for them. If the correction is well accepted, take more time to confirm with the patient that the visual experience matches their needs. Monovision or modified monovision corrections can also be simulated by selecting the appropriate monofocal or multifocal lenses for each eye. At any time, you can easily flip the correction between the dominant and the non-dominant eye. Again, remember to obtain the patient's feedback over the whole range of near, intermediate, and distance vision. This demonstration illustrates a Simvis Gecko examination in the clinical setting, simulating different types of presbyopic corrections and getting the feedback from the patient. It allows the ophthalmologist to select the optimal intraocular lenses for each patient, considering their perceptual feedback.